Oh, my glass is crooked. Oh, my God. My breasts are so saggy. I'm drinking on some hot ass Coke. Tastes great with my hot ass breath. I'm drinking. I'm very cleanly. Cleanliness is next to that. Hi, guys. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Back to my channel. Back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing Thrifty Thee Volume 5. Because why not? High five. High five. Because it's Volume 5. I just got out of the Stadius store, Stadius store, and I found Amy Winehouse back to black. So I had to pick it up because it's in its packaging and I plan to keep it that way until I get a CD player because I don't have a CD player. But I have a Kylie Minogue CD propped up on my jewelry organizer and I'm going to replace it with Amy Winehouse. They tried to make me go to rehab but I said hey, no, no, no. My mom is inside Play-Dohs right now, but I refuse to go to Play-Dohs. I played with Play-Doh as a kid, not as an adult. Play-Doh's closet, pretty sure they have a policy where they don't take clothes that are two years or older. And obviously, by the style, we know that I like clothes that are like seven years or older, or ten years or older. So, Play-Doh's closet never has anything that suits my fancy. So I don't even go in there. My mom's doing that right now. I did an outfit of the day video. If you're wondering about my deets, then go ahead and watch that if you want to see where everything's from and why I styled it, how I styled it, and just go ahead and watch that. But I'm gonna go walk to the thrift store right now. <laughs> I'm walking in the middle of the road. I just saw some bald guy's head and it was gleaming in the sun. I mean, now he's looking at me. How inappropriate. Ooh, don't blow the bang back. This bra is all padding, no boob. But it still looks like I could breastfeed you. It doesn't fit. I'm an A cup and I'm wearing a B cup right now. So my boobs are concave in my bra. Wow. I'm just walking to this Goodwill. It's so friggin' far. And the asphalt is glaring the sun up in my beautiful face. And actually, it might be tanning me. So, beauty is pain. I'm a, I love it. Why, Goodwill? Why? That's what I be saying, because their price is. Why, Goodwill? Why? It smells like cake farts. Wait, the cart was really loud. It smells like cake farts and chlorine in here. Let me repeat that. It smells like cake farts and chlorine in here. I didn't find any purses I liked. There was this hat. <laughs> Yo! Do the hoe down, throw down, babes. Um, there's an ugly clutch in here and some unicorn tape dispensers. Neither I want, so. I'm gonna go to the toy section way back there. Found some Sanrio. It's, does it say a year, 2014? Only $3.99. I think it has a little mark on it. It might be a little too kitty for me, so I'm gonna put it back. If this had a pink rim, I would totally get it. I mean, I could paint it pink. And it's if it said Draculaura's, <laughs> Wait, Draculaura doesn't even drink blood, but that's kind of cute. I haven't found cock a -doody. Nothing, so. Ew, I love it. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. Oh my god, I love it. Look at that. This is one of the things I actually ended up getting. I don't know why I didn't do a haul at the end of this video. So, whenever I see stuff I bought, I will go ahead and tell you. <gasps> I'm gonna wear that sometime soon. So, I thought I saw a cute boy. I realized he was wearing a Bass Pro hat, so I was like, instant, instant turn off. <laughs> Talk about a buzz kill. And he was so cute too, with flippy hair. Miss me. I found two pairs of Miss Me jeans, both in my size, so let's hope they fit. They're so cute, especially this pair. 
They're ultra low rise and the back has sequins. Isn't that so cool? Look at this sequin bandeau top I found. Oh, I'm definitely gonna be wearing this. Maybe to the club. Who knows? I'm gonna see if my mom likes this BB top. It looks like something she'd really like. So hopefully I can get her reaction. Okay, do you wanna see what I found you? Yes. No, I'm okay, so we'll do neck down. No, okay. Neck down. Ooh, this is what I found you. Do you like it? That's mine. It's a bandeau top. And those are the Miss Me jeans. What do you think about them? I found this shirt, but it has tiny spots on it. It's that. Custo Barcelona brand or whatever people love. I'm gonna let somebody else find it, but I'm sure one of y'all would die for this. This is my favorite era of Justice. I liked Limited 2 more, but these little animated food. I especially remember a cookie. They would have cookie shirts with different slogans and stuff on them. I used to love those. Somebody's whistling like Andy Griffith. I'm trying to wait until they do it again. Because it's so obnoxious. Come on. Hey guys, welcome to my channel and welcome back to my channel. Wait, I've already done the intro. Yeah, fine. No, I've already literally, I've already done this intro. This is like part two. This mm. is day number two. Um, I, f I forgot to do... Mom? I'm so sorry. Me talking? <laughs> sorry. I just want to do this really quick. They didn't put my cheese on the fries. They didn't? No. You can have some more. We are out thrifting again, but I'm wearing the dress that I got yesterday, or was it yesterday? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's really cute. With my Snooky purse, and I'm wearing pearls, because there's pearls on my anklet. Vintage Juicy. It has all these different colored charms. This is probably from, if I had to guess, it's probably from 2003 or four. Actually, later, probably 2005. Who knows? Oh! <laughs> Bump my head. I feel like the Three Stooges, they're always bumping their head, you know? I literally asked her, How am I supposed to eat cheese curds? I don't know. 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 Do you want to have a bite of your burger before you go out there? Pretty girls love mushroom Swiss burgers. Oh my gosh. So tan. So pretty. Sipping in my root beer. My ex really liked root beer and I drank it a lot when we were dating. But I continued to drink it after we broke up and I didn't let it like ruin, ruin root beer for me, you know? Do you ever just let a guy ruin something for you? Fun fact, I kept my ex's cologne because I wanted to smell it over and over again so that I didn't associate that cologne with him anymore. So if I ever smelt that cologne, I wouldn't even care. That's how much I was like, I wouldn't let in this guy ruin anything for me. I'm not gonna let him ruin Chanel men's cologne for him, no. So I'm gonna smell that Chanel men's cologne because whenever we, we, we broke up, he gave me Chanel cologne. He's like, he, he gave me a bag of stuff. I was like, why would I want your cologne to smell you? 
and I remember the first day I was like all emo I like sprayed the cologne on one of his old shirts and I was like smelled it and then I threw it in the dumpster and lit it on fire with kerosene is kerosene flammable <laughs> I should have just said lighter fluid is kerosene I think kerosene's yeah but I did keep the Chanel cologne because why would I let you know why would I ruin why would I throw away good Chanel cologne because of his you know it's fucking dumb but the root beer still tastes good I didn't let him ruin that for me either and talking about the same guy that guy also uh, texted me one time and I almost posted a TikTok about it he was like it's not 2009 stop dressing like it and thank the lord I didn't listen to him because that's what I'm known for you know Whenever I, whenever I eat, I just gorge. Look up that word, gorge. I be gorging. I be gorging, looking gorgeous. But I'm just gonna eat this Culver's and then we're gonna go in the thrift, so. I'm in the thrift store and at the little end cap, I found this XOXO wallet, which I actually really like, but it has a pee stain on it. Um, so we're not gonna get that and I don't think there's anything other than garbage so as soon as I came in one of the workers recognized me and they said aren't you that girl from TikTok and I was like yeah I'm getting much better at meeting you guys so if you ever see me in public be sure to say hi because I love it I showed her my nails and she really liked them but I don't know why I didn't ask her her name. That's like the one thought. Because I always forget to ask people's names, even in normal interactions. So I'm going to ask her name if I see her again, which I probably will. I'm like completely joking, but you know the girl that follows me that works here? You know, I wouldn't do this, but if I was that girl, I'd be like, could you sneak me some Hello Kitty stuff under the counter? JK. But I would do it. If I was just this much, if I was this much more desperate, I'd see how far my nails are apart. That's how, that's how much more desperate I'd have to be. Okay, somebody gave away their whole PS2 collection. I wish they had the Playboy game. That's the one game that I want. Uh, I don't know if they had it on the Xbox, but I know they had it on the PlayStation 2. This Abercrombie and Fish, <laughs> Abercrombie and Fish? No, Abercrombie and Fitch top is so cute it has pockets and a lacy detail i love empire waist stuff i'm not gonna get it though cause... okay i found out her name her name is maddie i don't know i'm just so spoiled you guys spoil me with all the love i enjoy talking to her a lot she is awesome everything is awesome Everything is awesome when you're part of a team. Everything is awesome. When you gotta move like a Lego character. I'm looking in the little girl section for Juicy Couture. I thought I could paint these and snookify them. Maybe zebra, maybe cheetah, maybe pink leopard. Uh, who knows? The options are endless. The possibilities are infinity <laughs> i don't know i was trying to think of a, another way to say that this is definitely the cutest baby sweater on the face of the planet it's a vintage mud baby sweater and it's the softest like cashmere it has a hood with little flowers on the side oh my god i wish i could get this for my child that i'm probably never gonna have because the world will end before that happens I'm filming this in like 2008, so the movie 2012 hasn't even came out yet, but I still know the world's gonna end. I really like this dress, but it's one stage or one trimester away from being a um, maternity dress. Doesn't it kind of look maternity? I love Empire Waistline, but... Pregnant. So, I just cracked the screen of this phone. And now my acrylic just got stuck in my hair.
I'm just thankful it didn't ruin the camera. We're still good. Cracked my phone to show you just this top that I think would look so cute on me if it was my size and not for a freaking infant. Can you even see what the screen looks like? It's cracked. <laughs> This is the only other thing that I got at the thrift store in this thrift with me. Sorry, I didn't show it off in a full haul. That is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching. Go ahead and comment, like, subscribe, all that goodness. I have another video coming at you today, so stay excited for that. Kisses to my bitches.